I see him. How far is he? All right, guys, well, finally turkey season here. If hunting them with the bow isn't hard enough, I have the dumb idea to make a cedar ground blind and have both of us sit on the ground behind it. So Riley and I are out here, we're here in Iowa, and uh, it's firing off in the bottom. Um, it's just breaking daylight, and we got a bunch of turkeys gobbling down in this bottom. Um, this spot, I knew it wasn't going to be right off the roof spot, but it's a great mid-morning spot, a little strut zone. Um, so we got the strutter out there. I've never actually sat with the strutter with the bow. Um, so we'll see how that works. If it doesn't work today, we'll bring out the jig tomorrow. But we're going to sit tight. We got the uh, head chopper on. And hopefully we can see him coming off to the right here, kind of through this brush. I can draw back. And then right when they get in this opening, I mean, this decoy is at about 12 yards, so <laughs> it's gonna be tight. But I'm, I'm pretty pumped at this. If this works out, this will be sweet. down this ridge and they flew down either into this field or in this bottom right now i think they're just kind of all scattered here but like i was saying it's up in here it's just a good midday strut zone so hopefully they work their way up here a couple of hens have been firing off which is good close to us they're still hammering 30 minutes after fly down which is good A little Chinese fire drill. We got some toms that they seem to be working their way a little bit. They're still down on the bottom. Um, but the sun came out and I really didn't count for the sun. And where we were set up just five yards right here, it's getting beamed on. So we moved in these cedars even thicker, bumped the decoy a little bit closer. Decoy's still at like 13 yards. We're pretty bulletproof now, I feel, back here though. So we'll see if these. Doms keep working their way, and we didn't scare them away being loud and getting set up. Wrapping up, we're gonna go, we're gonna go scout around and get another spot ready for tomorrow morning. Um, we got some work stuff to do today, so we're calling it a day probably go pick out a spot over where those gobbles were this morning. Well, day number two, we got one hammering right on the other side of the field. The blind we set up midday yesterday might actually pay off. So if we, this guy pitches down in the field, we got a Jake decoy out in front of us and hopefully he's all PO'd at, at this Jake and comes, puts a show on for us. But I'm gonna start calling a little bit. There's three hens just mad at each other. We got three. 
three hens that are just causing a ruckus about 150 yards on the field, which is really good. He's got, she's got these toms fired up. I don't think the tom that's close has flown down yet. I'm so surprised that there's not a strutter with them. More left? And I don't see it. Is it like right here? Oh, I see him. One to the left, my party. <laughs> Just hope he sees a decoy. Which it might. That's why. What's that? Okay. I see him. How far is he? To shoot this one as soon as he turns, I'll draw. Dude, oh my gosh. I can't believe we freaking did that, Riley. <laughs> Dude, I'm really, I'm really shook up right now. I like big buck level right now. It was just so intense and popping out in the field 200 yards. And then he walked by us at like 15 and I'm just like out the corner of my eye. And then he stood there at the decoy forever. Oh man, just a perfect shot, dude.
I'm all shook up. <laughs> oh gosh. Wow. That was fun, man. So we had we had a suspicion that they were gonna be roosting in that tree, but they just kind of roosted randomly and man, it worked out so good. It almost didn't work out. I was nervous he was gonna hug this edge so tight. <laughs> Just a pretty bird. The lighting's so cool too. Shows off all of his colors. Man, I, not only is like bow hunting very challenging, it's it's uh, way more rewarding. It's very frustrating. Last year in Iowa, we hunted for so long and uh, we never had like, it just all work together. So it feels so good for it to work pretty early too second morning decent spurs nothing crazy beautiful bird we get them tagged tagged and bagged grab my arrow and we can get breakfast at a decent time <laughs> 